Once Alan unlocked the front door, we were officially open for business. Um, oh, can I help nice. you or? We're here to, uh, for the TV deals. Um, just so you guys know, we do have a strict uh, dress code, as you can see, on the wall, so. Wow. There's no advertising about the dress code. Yeah, yeah. That's I mean, it's right in the front of our yeah, store. That, 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 it's for that's everyone to see. Store. This it's is the front. Of it's inside. inside. We were waiting out there. But that's, we were waiting in the front of the store. That's I knew some people might be a bit frustrated, so I offered up a list of tuxedo rental stores in the area to show them that Spears did value their business. Honestly, you seem like very nice people, and I'd love to let you in, but I think doing so would be unfair to the customers that you know chose to dress decent. What the? My plan on the Spears TV side was working, as 30 minutes after opening, exactly zero of his $1 televisions had been purchased. Meanwhile, everything was on track with my buyers, as they were just now arriving at Best Buy. But then, to my surprise, a customer actually returned with a tire that met our strict dress code. Did you rent that? Yes. I wasn't completely shocked that someone would be determined enough to make it inside, but I was hopeful that the remaining steps would prove more discouraging. So uh, this is the section with those TVs. Okay. Um, it's the premium TV section? Yeah. That's the doorway? Yeah. These are the more expensive ones, okay. so we keep them in a separate room. That's going to be in there? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. That's not good. Um, yeah. The customer may have been determined, but once he came face to face with our alligator, it was all over. I, I, I'm sorry, I mean, I feel bad because that's a dollar we're losing as well, you know? My plan was a success. The guy chose not to buy the dollar TV, and every customer after that met our dress code got no further than Herbert as well. Herbert? What is Herbert? <laughs> I'm sorry, did you not want a TV or? Yeah, I don't want to be in the same room as an alligator. Everything seemed to be going according to plan, but then I got word that back at Best Buy, things weren't looking so hot. After presenting the flyer to sales associates, my buyers were told that the company would not honor their price match. We price match to an actual store's price, not to This is a store, price. and this is their price. Yeah, that sounds great. I couldn't understand why this was happening, so I left the shop and headed over to Best Buy to see if I would have any better luck myself. I actually have a price match for this to get it for a oh, dollar. Uh, here's, we don't price match here. Why not? They're not a uh, local competitor. They are. They're within 25 miles. Uh, we don't there's no way anybody's going to price match that TV no matter what company you go to. Even with my confidence and negotiation skills, I was denied a price match too. I'm going to count to three, and if you don't do it by the time I get to three, I'm going to leave, okay? One, two, three. It's not going to happen. I couldn't believe it. How could Best Buy, one of my favorite companies, turn their backs on the very policy that drew me in as a customer?